Hello, people. Oh, so I decided to do something other than stories or animations and try doing gaming. I don't know if it's gonna work, <laughs> but it might. It might. So, today I'm gonna be playing Terraria, and as you can tell, it's sped up, and this isn't the original commentary for the video. I did do some commentary, but I don't like how the audio turned out, and, you know, it. the original footage is like an hour. <laughs> so, yeah. And I'm not voicing something over for an hour, and I don't think you really want to watch the same thing for an hour. Unless it's a movie. But pretty much, um, at this point, I started wishing that I may have gone mage because, you know, the first chest I got had a wand of sparking. But I, yeah, I'm gonna go ranger in this run through. <clears throat> And pretty much every time one of those slimes showed up, I thought I was going to die. Like, that purple slime, I thought it was going to kill me. <laughs> but right now I'm getting some stone so that I can make myself a house. Because, you know, I need somewhere to make sure zombies don't eat my brains. At least, I hope they don't eat my brains. So, yeah. <laughs> If you've never played Terraria, you definitely should, because it is so much fun. Um, so right now I'm just kind of going to upgrade to Flaming Arrows, that way, you know, I can kill stuff in less hits and have better defense. Um, in case you didn't tell, because I didn't quite pay much attention, um, but I made the same bow repeatedly to try to get the demonic modifier because that's the best modifier for ranger I think it is at least but because woods really easy to get so like if you're playing as a warrior just keep making swords till you get legendary it's just a great power boost then right now I'm questioning how I ran out well I was questioning for like five seconds for how I ran out of mana then I remembered I was missing a ton <laughs> Oh yeah, and then I got like really lucky and got that slime staff. I'm just like, I had to choose Ranger, <laughs> didn't I? But I'm glad I'm going with Ranger because I really like going Ranger. But the slime staff did come in handy, and there's no way I'm, you know, deleting it because that is such a rare drop. And especially so early in the game, it was just absolutely awesome to get it that early. I mean, I guess if I want, I can switch my class. But if I had to choose of all the classes to be, I would definitely choose Mage. Okay, so right now I'm still getting more stone. I can use clay, but I'm probably just going to use clay for, like, furniture, like plates and bowls. Just kind of, you know, make the house look a little better. Oh, I did not make, get to make very much stone. Or gray break. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't really know what to say at this point. But right now what I'm trying to do is start the foundation for my house. Because, you know, I'm kind of panicking trying to get my house started. Because it's already, you know, past noon. And I don't want to have, like, an awful first night. Although I do wind up spending, like, most of my night in the cave because zombies don't go down there I guess yeah, it'd be smarter for the zombies to go down there so at this point I was going to work on the foundation right then and there but it was becoming late and I didn't want to run out of time so I decided I'll do the foundation later um, so I just start working on the door frame and I also start panicking partway through because I'm really low on wood. So I go chop down some more trees. And it was scary. <laughs> I it was so low on time. I love how I say I'm low on time while I 
put fences in the door frame. But um, yeah. So pretty much I just went with a box roof, or kind of a normal roof, and then just started putting stuff in. Oh, you know, I have a place to live. But now I'm working on the foundation, and I completely forgot to start, you know, making it suitable for the guide, because he's actually useful at this part of the game, because then I know what I can craft, because I don't ever remember what I can craft. So, yeah. It's probably the hardest stage of the game. <laughs> at least in my opinion, because a slime can kill you. But, um, yeah. Oh yeah, I love how I was talking about how it'd be pretty embarrassing if, like, I died. My first death was to a slime. Because, yeah, that, they're the easiest mob in the game. Oh yeah, and from this point on, that lemon that I just picked up, it's going to stay right there in my hotbar until I kill Moonlord. It will be my victory lemon. And I will eat it only when I kill Moonlord. Then I can eat my victory lemon. So while recording this audio, I'm just watching that bunny and it moves so fast. Oh jeez, it's nighttime. Okay, get in the house, get in the house. Why? Why am I feel like I'm playing the game? <laughs> so yeah, right now I'm making the walls so that the guide moves in. Now you know, he doesn't get his brain eaten by zombies. And then, I realized how weird the door frame looks, so I placed some blocks there, that way it looks better. And, for some reason, at least in my opinion, it made the, the roof look five times better. So, right now I decided to go look for more, more loot underground. And, I also found some bombs up there. I guess they dropped from the slime. And there's a demon eye, and I got a lens on my first try. Now I just get some more stuff. I'm definitely gonna save the, um, shrine potion for later. Because it's really useful in the jungle where I'd want my um, weapons in hand rather than a torch. And I'm just continuing to go through there. I found a chest there. Oh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I actually completely forgot to pick up that other chest. Oh, you know, just watch as like later in the run. I just try to loot it and I realize it's empty. I picked up some silver ore, and I'm talking about how, or at least I was talking about how, I'm not going to spend any time mining for copper, because, like, wood is better than copper sometimes. Like, with weapons, it's better. With armor, I'm pretty sure it's, I'm pretty sure it's the same. I don't know. Never bothered to make copper armor. But, um, l later in the video, you'll kind of see why I brought that up. Maybe in a few seconds or a minute. But, um, Yeah. That red slime is scary, though. So right now I'm just, you know, placing torches, which you can see. So I don't really know why I'm commenting on that. But, you know, I need to talk somewhere in the video, so may as well talk here in the video. And as you can see, I shot up through that hole to, you know, make sure they're... See if they're... English. To make sure there wasn't a... Uh, wait, no, but I want third. Okay, a shack with a golden chest, that's what I was looking for. But right now I'm mining gold, and I'm not going to fight the Eye of Cthulhu until I get full gold armor and a golden bow. And I was going to get either Jester arrows or Unholy arrows, but I'm pretty sure Frostburn arrows would be better because I really like the debuff. Right now I'm mining some Amethyst to um, sell because, you know... Yeah, I can make some good money off of it, and I want to get the mega, sh the me not the mega shark, the mini shark as soon as I can. And that that thing's expensive. At least when you don't have much money, because it's the beginning of the game, it's expensive. And right now I'm getting cobwebs so that, or a s few seconds ago I was getting cobwebs so that I can make a bed, but in the and I only make two silk, which is like three less than I need. And then. I found explosives. <laughs> I could not resist the explosives. So, yeah, I may have lied a bit when I said I wasn't going to mine any copper, but how was I supposed to know that there would be a detonator right there? 
So right now it's nighttime and I'm just kind of running for my life to get into my house, seeing what I can craft. Hmm. Easy. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> and then I wanted to make the gem hook, but I couldn't. But the funny part is, if I would have gone mage, I bet I would have, I absolutely bet I would not have found those amethysts or that copper. <laughs> what did I do with the amethysts and copper? I don't know, we'll see later in the video. If I did do anything. I don't know. Chances are I might switch to mage, just to make the video a little easier. Just, you know, I decided to do this in expert mode. Not master mode, not classic mode, but expert mode. Even though I'm not an expert. <laughs> Oh, but yeah, that's mainly because I've done a master mode playthrough with my friends, and I've beaten classic mode a bunch on my own. So I just kind of wanted to try out expert mode, because, like, it's been around for years, but I've never really tried it. Other than to, you know, make fun of Moonlord with my overpowered mage character. <laughs> At least in 1.3 it was overpowered. That was on mobile. Anyway, <laughs> so right now I'm proceeding to, I did just, you know, casually call my wooden bow poopy because it only does five damage, and I'm about to, you know, replace it with my iron bow. But then, I get, you know, an awful reforge on it. Now, I decided to say before I left, oh, what could go wrong? It's not like I'm going to die. Yeah, then I get swarmed by enemies, and I do drink my first potion, but still. I'm surprised I didn't die earlier. First death of the game. What could have gone wrong, I said. I'm not going to die, I said. <laughs> but yeah, I went to go retrieve my gold, but a zombie grabbed it and despawned because of his day. That's the worst time to get killed by a zombie, is daytime. So, yeah. So at this point, I decide I'm going to upgrade to Frostburn arrows to, you know, gonna get that good debuff. But, um, yeah. So that's pretty much what I do for the rest of the video. I wanted to chop down that tree because I like palm wood, but it just took too long. And... <laughs> I did not want to wait that long for wood. Oh yeah, and then I had some run-ins with vultures. Which was not very fun for me. Then I shot two, which was not a very good idea. So yeah, right now I'm killing an Antland Charger, which they do a lot of damage. Like, I tried to jump over it, and then it did, like, 40-something damage. It's, like, the same amount Moonlord does when you have, you know, good armor. Oh, yeah, I got my step stool. Step stool! But for some reason, it doesn't increase my jump height. So, like, I can't stand on it and, like, jump off of it, which is a little disappointing. And then I decided, um, I'm probably gonna die of an ice slime. And then I decided not to kill that ice slime. But then, my big brain's just like, oh, that's some in my, uh, minion. And then I realized, might not be a good idea when there's a, a monster nearby that I don't want to fight. But luckily, my, my baby slime dealt with it quickly. Okay, so, the audio did cut out, but pretty much my... My slime dealt with it quickly and effectively, and I learned, um, do not summon slime when slime nearby. Slime bad, not good. No. Um, but pretty much, yeah. Enjoy the next 16 hours of your life. Yes, this is a thr- I mean, um, there is no layer of cows. Goodbye.